Alright everybody, what is going on and welcome back to another video. I'm, I'm actually really excited to be making this video. This is something I've wanted to do on this channel for a long time, but it's something I, I didn't feel ready to, and also I didn't, I didn't want to. And I, I hadn't found anyone suitable enough for me to do this yet. But I'm happy to say that I certainly have now. Over the last two years, if you've been following this channel, you will have seen my journey into the world of American football. It's been absolutely incredible. Throughout that time, there's been three athletes that are doing their own thing in their own lives, grinding away, working towards the major goal that a lot of, that a lot of people in America are doing, and that is towards playing professional American football. Now, throughout the last two years, I've been in contact with three athletes in particular. These athletes struck me as good people, but as well as that, they've got the skills and the passion, the size, the strength, the speed, the hops to match. And that is the only reason why I am putting myself and my YouTube channel behind these guys to try and get them to the place that, that they deserve to be. So this video series is going to cover these three athletes. There's going to be a series of videos for each and they are going to go in this order. The first video is going to be me telling their story. So I've gone and asked them recently, and it's a pretty big ask, for them to go put pen to paper and write their story. Write their story the way that they want it told. Write their story with, with as much you know, detail, all the stats, injuries, ups, downs, everything, so that then I can grab that story and convey it on this channel. That's going to be the first video for each of these athletes. The second video is going to be my reaction to their highlights, okay, which I haven't done. I've looked at probably about a minute's worth of footage for each of these three athletes, knowing that in future I'm not going to look at this footage on purpose because I know that the first time I'm going to want to look at it is when I'm doing a reaction to them on my channel. All I know is that they do have the skill and they do have the size, the strength, the power, the speed to make it at the next level. And I want to react to that with my audience because I know, I know that someone out there watching these videos is going to see this talent, hear their stories and give them the shot that they fucking deserve. That's what I hope to happen. It's not about me anymore. I tell you what, the one, I tell you what, one of the reasons why I haven't made these videos is because I didn't want to promote another athlete above myself on my own channel because I was still too selfish and too focused on my own journey. You know, if I wasn't going to make it as a professional athlete, I'm not going to help anyone else do it. But at the end of the day, I'm not feeling like that anymore. I'm feeling like there's enough room in this world for everybody. I'm feeling like if I was going to get that, that chance, if someone was going to reach out to me and give me that chance, it probably would have already happened and it hasn't. So I'm now putting my efforts into other athletes. And that may be how this channel continues into the future. Who knows? But anyways, guys, this is just an introduction. So we're going to have... Me telling their story, the second video is going to be Rugby Player Reacts to their highlights. The third video is going to be me clipping all their highlights together and putting it up on YouTube through my channel as a highlight clip, so, you know, similar to a huddle video or something like that. Basically, so that a coach or a prospective coach can grab their highlights, easily you know, take a link or download it and, and show it to other people without having me talk or react to it. So the fourth video in each of these athletes, I'm extremely excited about. And this is, this is probably going to be the, the, this is probably going to be my favorite part of this entire video series. And that is a quick fire 20 questions with each of these athletes. So I'm going to put together a video, a question and answer video for each of these three athletes. And I'm going to put it together so that it's as if they're being asked the question and then they're giving their answer. It's going to be interactive. It's going to be fantastic. It's going to give them a real chance to talk to my audience, to talk to any prospective coaches out there and really give their own personal take on the questions that I ask. I selected 20 questions. I, I wrote them myself. I feel like they're great questions. I feel like they're going to really delve deep into who these guys are, what makes them tick and where they want to go. In the world of professional football. So, I feel like it's my duty to do this. I promised each of these three guys that I would do this. 
There have been many others, many other subscribers of mine that have sent their highlights through that have asked me to do this. But for whatever reason, it hasn't worked. I, I, I possibly I've forgotten about it. And so I've selected three athletes. I, I couldn't have done this with 10 or 20 athletes. It's just too much time, too much work. I needed three, I've got them, and you're about to meet them in the next video. So I'll give you their names. Armin Van Ass. He is a South African. He's 19. He's a tight end, and he wants to play in the NFL. We've got Ruben Linton II. He's 27. He lives in America. He's had some ups and downs, but he's ready to give it his final shot, and I'm trying to help him with that. And third, last but not least, we've got Dave Rodriguez. Dave Rodriguez and I have been in touch for a year and a half. He offered to help me train when I was getting ready for my own combine last year. He's, he's offered to help me train many, many times. He said, bro, next time you're in New York, next time you're in Miami, hit me up, let's train. I honestly thought I would have been over there 18 months ago, but I'm not. And so I'm still in touch. I've always promised to do this for you, Dave, and that's what we're doing. So Dave Rodriguez is the wide receiver of the group, or safety. Ruben is the running back of the group, or kick returner. And Armin is the big man of the group. He's a tight end, or a defensive end, but he's going for tight end. He likes to be on offense. Although I will say that the way these guys are talking, they will accept any position on any semi-pro or pro team and they definitely deserve it. And that's the only reason why I'm doing this, guys. So any coaches out there that respect my opinion, that watch my videos, look out for these guys. If you don't have an opportunity for them, you're definitely gonna know someone that might. If nothing comes of this, it is what it is, but I will be putting all of their contact details in the description box below each video. So, you know, you won't have to go through me effectively. You can just go straight to them. I'm so excited for this video series. Much more excited about this than anything I've done recently with the draft, with the combine. In fact, the only thing I could think of whilst watching both the combine and the draft was, I just wish that these three guys were there. I wish that these guys were there. I wish that somehow, some way, they could get an invite to the combine and just showcase what they've got. I know it doesn't work like that, but once we get into these guys' stories, which I haven't actually read yet, then I guess anything's possible. Guys, I'm going to leave you there, I'm going to finish my coffee, and I'm going to get into video number one, the tight end from South Africa, Armin. So mate, I want to say good luck, good luck to all three of these fellas, and let's see you in the pros. Peace out.